ओके सर गुड मॉर्निंग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द सेकेंड एडिशन ऑफ ऑरेंज सिटी लिटरेचर फेस्ट विच इज ऑर्गेनाइज बाय सी जी आर नॉलेज फाउंडेशन आई एम प्राची चांदेकर योर एंकर फॉर द सेशन दिस सेशन इज ऑफ फोर्टी मिनिट्स एंड द टॉपिक ऑफ द सेशन इज हाउ टू सर्वाइव स्टूडेंट लाइफ एंड फाइंड अ जॉब यू लव students from age group 20 uh, 12 to 20 i am very pleased to welcome the speaker of the session chandan deshmukh sir sir is a tedx speaker a 30 year old bangalore based electronics and communication engineer by chance and an sap basis engineer by profession while in school and college so i preferred reading smart students over textbook this enabled him to unearth the plethora of secrets that are laid bare in his books six secrets smart student don't tell you and seven dream jobs and how to find them which have sold more than 1 lakh copies so far theater is sir's first love and he has acted and anchored on and of the screen when he is not scaring his family with weird philosophy he is likely to be swimming traveling skydiving or bungee jumping i welcome you sir and would like to session over over to you sir thanks a lot prachi that, that was a fantastic introduction thank you uh, for that and uh, hello everybody uh, thank you for joining in so it's a uh, lazy morning on a saturday uh, you know 11 am and yet you chose to be here uh, instead of you know uh, being in your pajamas and watching the television thank you for that and i congratulate on your persistence and uh, perseverance and uh, you know trying to learn new things uh, com which comes in your way uh, thank you everybody for joining in so uh, i'm chandan deshmukh uh, i'm from bengaluru i'm an author uh, engineer and a skydiver uh, so today we'll be uh, you know uh, exploring views on 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 you know um how to survive uh, student life and uh, choose the the job you love yeah so uh, let me start sharing my screen uh, and present to you Sure. Let me start sharing this slide. Yes, please. So I hope it's visible. So uh, these are the two books which um, I have written with Penguin. Uh, random house publishers uh, the first one is six secrets smart students don't tell you uh, and the second is uh, seven dream jobs and how to find them um, i thought that you know uh, only relatives and friends would buy it yeah <laughs> however it went on to sell more than 1.2 lakh copies so far and counting thanks to uh, uh, people like you and uh, there are a lot of reviews uh, that the books are uh, of a great help to them Uh, i'm really elated thank you uh i was featured in uh, the media uh, right from you know the times of india the written media until the uh, radio stations these are the snippets of a uh, few reviews yeah let's dive into the subject so what's your secret to studying uh so it's a secret i'll not tell you these the, i mean a uh, lot of uh, topper students uh, they tend to keep it a secret uh, and i was a below average student yeah uh, so beat any subject i by heart notes that is what uh, i was trying to do uh, in, during my schooling and i belong to the same tribe um, i was a below average student all my friends were in the top ranks first rank to 10th rank i was the odd man out 
yeah uh, laughing at the pranks of the last benchers and getting help from the first benchers during a test was a daily affair for me uh, however one day changed everything which is the most horrible horrendous terrible tremendous day in the life of a student many tell me that it's the exam day right but friends no only a below average student like me can say that uh, it's the parent teacher meeting right so uh, even i had to attend the parent teacher meeting i i went in uh, and as soon as i went in uh, my class teacher had the updated complaints on to my mom uh, right from getting five out of 25 in social studies uh, making animal sounds in class uh, so on so forth yeah it was updated until the previous day completely updated list on complaints so uh, and to put the icing on the cake my uh, my class teacher she unveiled the midterm marks card to my mom and it read c plus as if adding one more plus would have made my future resume strong the whole staff room turned silent and uh, i i just saw my mom's face and she was crying i i i felt like you know shouting out loud mom please don't cry please hit me till you are satisfied not this silent cry so friends that day i decided one thing i had a new enemy my class teacher right so uh, my only aim was to bring back the lost sheen on my mom's face and prove my teacher wrong i met diverse people i i started studying the brilliant students more than the textbook uh, you know right from uh, i start i started shadowing all their activities right from how they tie the shoelaces until how they brainstormed so uh, i bribed them with delicious home food and uh, shadowed most of the activities yeah and i have unveiled them uh, in my first book six secrets smart students don't tell you yeah so uh, i request you to you know go through the book you know purchase it and uh, you know please note uh, the book is cheaper than a mcdonald meal so please go ahead and uh, purchase the book so uh, today uh, friends let's discuss two serious important things yeah to understand this you need a phd in neuroscience first salman khan's marriage signature in the air very difficult things so let, let's move on so rahul he has final examinations 10 days from now yeah so uh, i believe you, uh, you know you'll also have some examination in the coming days uh, so i think you can correlate so uh, rahul he sits with all the books uh, as per his curriculum 11:30 am he makes a plan i'll finish studying all the subjects today have we done this i think so right most of us so uh, we plan to do everything in a single day right so rahul is uh, not different so he also plans the same let's see what happens to him however at around 12:15 pm a monkey comes in uh believe you me this this monkey is not an outside monkey not a physical monkey this is inside of us yeah uh, it says bro let's check facebook bro let's youtube let's let's google many things yeah uh we have 10 more days to go let's take a break come on let's chill so rahul he gives the steering of his life to the uh, monkey the uh and and for the next 7 days let's enjoy bro they they're just having chill out time they they're partying they they're going out with friends playing cricket the whole day and uh, watching television okay a new trailer has come up watching the youtube videos so he's having a gala time but mind you uh though he's having a gala time uh, he's partying at the back of his mind there is a guilt yeah uh should i should i start studying or uh, you know am i doing wrong but still the monkey the the instant gratification monkey uh, it says no no rahul 
let's come back let's enjoy we still have a lot of time yeah and uh, if if the monkey was in the animal world yeah it would have been a huge success if you're a dog and uh, if you can you know wag your tail have food procreate and have a good time with, with your with the owner then it's a huge success however rahul is in the human world right so we all have some activities to perform and uh, we all have to uh, you know study or work or or do the daily chores so rahul has given the steering of his life to instant gratification monkey let's see what happens so the instant gratification monkey is not afraid of anything except the anxiety monster so this anxiety monster comes in only when there is uh, a public embarrassment uh, expected or you know uh, there is a deadline which is upcoming you know only then this anxiety monster comes in yeah so as soon as the anxiety monster comes in two days before the examination uh, the anxiety monster comes in and uh, the 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 instant gratification monkey is horrified the whole system is in mayhem tomorrow is the examination and rahul uh, he is with the textbook and monkey go, goes back to the tree and you know uh, it's it's a disaster rahul pulls an all nighter just before the examination however he couldn't do well in the examination so friends can we all relate to this uh, story of rahul but do we do this often yes right we do this often we we try to procrastinate things and uh, you know uh, push it aside you know in case the, the i mean we make a plan right so okay 10 am i'll start studying uh, social studies right so if it is 10 2 3 am you know 10 10 2 am then immediately we we zero in and we round off hey let's let's sit at 10 30 am you know we try to procrastinate and uh, you know we, we try to put things uh, on the last day bucket yeah so uh, we usually do that however many people tell me that uh, bringing in anxiety monster earlier is the key to it yeah and this is based on the analysis from tim urban so uh, what can we do on this uh, scenario you know what can we learn from rahul's uh, story can we kill the monkey you know finish it or finish the story yeah can we do so no it's an inside monkey yeah the instant gratification is inside us so uh, we can't kill the monkey so what what else can we do can we sit with the anxiety monster on a daily basis every day unfortunately not because it comes in only when the embarrassment is near or a deadline is uh, you know at the brim so even that's not possible so what do we do you can't kill the monkey so reward the monkey reward so so how do we reward a monkey yeah so uh, a few techniques are like you know uh, take some break off you know uh, uh, and award yourself whenever uh, you, you complete a chapter or or uh, you know complete solving uh, one of the toughest uh, uh, questions in the exam so uh, just award yourself Uh, by eating a chocolate or an ice cream or or uh, go to the refrigerator browse few things yeah uh, or else uh, you know uh, you know if, if you accomplish one of the uh, better goals then you can watch a uh, you know a movie you know simple aspects of rewarding yourself so i would suggest you to uh, study for 50 minutes Uh, at a stretch yeah uh, 30 to 50 minutes at a stretch and then take a break of 10 minutes yeah so it's around 50 minutes of study and 10 minutes of rewarding the monkey 50 then mind you it's not the other way around 50 minutes of rewarding the monkey and 10 minutes of studying yeah great 
So uh, this was about the procrastination and uh, one of the study technique of uh, the 5010. Let's move on. Brownie points. So uh, I have uh, put forth few of the uh, you know, excerpts from the book. Uh, you know, just to give you a, a heads up and and also a taste of what you can expect. So uh, let let's compare uh, the uh, the studying uh, to the real time cricket. Yeah. So here we start the innings with average six runs per hour with the target of uh, 375. Right. So yesterday, if you watch the cricket, India versus Australia, uh, India couldn't fare well uh, because they didn't. Uh, manage the uh, the run rate yeah so similarly in our studies you know if if you're targeting you know uh, a distinction score um then you can't do it in a jiffy you can't sit on the exam eve uh, with all the textbooks and start studying and score more right that's that's practically not possible so start your innings with average six runs per over so start from the start of the academic calendar right so sit with the book start slow take baby steps you know one page at a time and eventually with time uh, you'll be able to uh, reach your uh, distinction score yeah so please make notes uh, start slow and don't uh, you know gulp it at a time during the end of the uh, academic year uh, the second brownie point is practice at any time of the day Few people tell me, you know, ask me that, you know, uh, Chandan, should I study in the morning, 5 a.m. or at night? You know, I don't know. Sometimes I'm nocturnal. Sometimes uh, I'm an early bird. I don't know. I don't know what to do. So, friends, if you have such a predicament, I would suggest, please uh, study at any time of the day. Yeah, it doesn't matter. There is uh, there is a study which says that um, the time of the day doesn't matter. For the grasping power yeah so unless and until you don't have a, a sumptuous and a heavy lunch or dinner uh, you can study at any point of the day yeah uh, just imagine uh, you have examination 15 minutes from now uh, at around 3 pm uh, you know if, if you feel it you just have 15 minutes time then immediately you'll skim through the textbook yeah left right and center and immediately your grasping power reaches the the horizon right so it means that uh, uh, no matter it's 3 p.m or 5 a.m or 10 p.m or 1 p.m in case you are uh, accustomed with that time then please go ahead study at that time and please uh, study at the same time to uh, you know on a regular basis you know it's not like uh, you know you study at 5 a.m on day one and day two you, you study at 8 p.m and day three, uh, you know, 3, 3 p.m. You know, if you keep on fluctuating, then uh, the concentration level might differ because of your body clock, yeah? So you can practice at any time of the day, but, uh, you know, try to keep it, uh, you know, regular, yeah, consistent. So the next uh, brownie point is uh, comparing to the, um, you know, uh, cricket, uh, strategic timeouts and drink breaks are compulsory. You can't, uh, you know, you can't just run a uh, marathon uh, with with a uh, with a continuous pace, right? You you can't uh, you can't start the marathon just like how you face a sprint. So the the way you uh, compete at a sprint and the way you compete at marathon is completely different, right? So similarly, you'll have to take some strategic timeouts and drink breaks. As I said, 50-10 rule, uh, so that you don't burn out, uh, you don't burn yourself out, yeah, and you can uh, go for a, a longer period of time. You can sustain uh, the study time. Yeah, so timeouts are compulsory. The next point is, you know, even Sachin Tendulkar and MS Dhoni needed a coach. So it doesn't matter you you are a you are a below average student or, or a first rank student or you know you're a genius doesn't matter you all need teachers right so uh, try to be humble have some humility and uh, talk to your teachers have a coach uh, you know reach out to him or her on a regular basis 
and uh, clarify your doubts uh, be down to earth and ask questions you know it need not be i mean there are no bad questions right so uh, you can reach out to them in person or during the class or or any time uh, so nowadays uh, teachers are very open to whatsapp uh, you know questionnaires so please try to reach out to them and clarify all your doubts yeah so you all need a coach and a teacher it doesn't uh, mean that you can you know just go on your own it doesn't happen yeah so let's move on um the next point is every top batsman suffer from out of form but they make a comeback with a century so friends uh, sometimes you might be feeling down yeah low so there will be high and lows in in any uh, person's uh, you know life so similarly uh, at this point of time you might be facing a, a low right so you might not be doing well in in the uh, examinations or, or in your personal life however uh, fret not uh, just like how an out of form batsman comes back to form with a century plan ahead and uh, you know uh, motivate yourself and then come back to form yeah uh, the last point is players work hard and party harder so similarly don't you know just be in your bedroom all day study well prepare well and party hard and and now in this uh, crucial covid times party softer <laughs> so uh, let's move on so these were the the topics and, and the ideas uh, in terms of studying techniques yeah so other than these there are many more like uh, time management memory technique there there are many uh, tips and techniques in which uh, you can cultivate uh, wherein uh, you can have 500 page book on your tongue just like back of your hand yeah so uh, there are many techniques and and if you want to do well uh, in in your uh, life uh, other than your peers then you'll have to uh, you know inculcate few techniques which they are not doing right so that is where these books come in handy uh, six secrets smart students don't tell you and seven dream jobs and how to find them the very uh, you know budgety book so you can purchase it at around 150 190 rupees uh cheaper than a mcdonald meal so please go ahead uh, book it on flipkart amazon or uh, near your bookstore yeah let's move ahead the second point is signature in the air so what do you want to be in future uh, i assume you, you are uh, a teenager uh, who is attending the the session a teenager or uh, in your early 20s um or a parent yeah so uh, what do you want to be in future or your kid uh, what does he or she want to be in future so have you given it a thought so um sometimes many people feel that you know i don't know one day i want to be an astronaut the other day uh, i want to do something else uh, they are not linked at all one day even i was in the same path one day i wanted to be a temple priest yeah the other day i wanted to uh, you know fly an airplane so it it differs and you are not alone guys so these are normal these are normal so let's see how uh, we can find out dream job so this is an excerpt from the uh, from uh, you know the media many of the uh, newspaper cutouts yeah so if you observe many people are losing jobs bsnl the government jobs which are said to be very safe they are cutting the workforce physicians healthcare workers they are they are getting laid off it workers i mean don't get me started they are they are facing massive layoffs uh, the lawyers because of the algorithms legal work they are they are getting laid off so i mean why are people losing jobs right uh i agree that these are difficult times i mean even before these uh, covid times came in even before this people were getting laid off right why is that have you given it a thought so many people tell me that because of the automation which has come in people are losing jobs yeah yeah might be that is one of the uh, category however 
because of automation there are many other automation jobs which have come in yeah so i don't think that that is a uh, you know the the, the right uh, you know uh, reason so uh, many people tell me that uh, you know maybe they were not fit for the job they were not interested in the job i think so yes yeah so uh, you know i had a friend uh, who 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 was uh, an extrovert yeah he used to party hard and um, he couldn't sit at one place yeah uh, however just because uh, his uh, you know relatives and friends told that hey go to a coding job uh, you know a dev- be a developer or a software engineer you can earn a handsome um, salary so he he got into the job yeah and no prizes for guessing uh, after a couple of months he couldn't face it you know uh, he couldn't sit at one place and keep on coding because that was not his cup of tea he couldn't sit at one place yeah he was he was an extrovert he wanted to meet people you know um, talk to them get the get the deals done so it was his regime however this kind of job was not his uh, strength yeah so uh, many people you know just to um, you know pay the bills uh, they'll they'll get into rat race and uh, they want to do something uh which is not very comfortable yeah you might have seen people uh, who on a daily basis wake up uh, from the bed and feel are yaar should i go to the office uh, should i really go are there any ways i can take a chutti you know so these are the red signs in which you feel you know it's not the the right place you are in yeah so uh, here is a statistic guys um for 11 hours a day for the rest of your life you'll either be working or thinking about work now imagine being stuck in the wrong job very difficult huh it's like you know half of your uh, more than half of your awake time you are uh, you know uh, stuck in your life yeah so as per a survey 80% of indians hate their jobs why is that i mean Uh, it's mind boggling right i mean have you given it a thought still people want to go to uh, such jobs you know just to um, fill in their uh, you know uh, kitty and then you know pay the regular bills yeah so i think we'll have to think uh, different gone are the gone are those days wherein you know you just had to be uh, an engineer or a doctor or a lawyer yeah now uh people are people are creating jobs new jobs uh you know if you if you observe uh, 50 years ago if anybody told you that you can make a living uh, just by speaking people would have had a belly burst laughter right so now if you observe uh, youtubers uh, and then the 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 gamers uh, and then the um, vloggers uh they are they making merry right so uh, they are earning eight figures nine figures in a year so i request you to explore options before you make a decision yeah so find your signature find your signature here here is um, here is an activity for you raise your hand your writing hand yeah whichever is your predominant hand and draw your signature in the air just just do a signature in here i hope you you have found out your signature already yeah great so raise your hand your your predominant hand and draw your signature in here yeah great now raise your other hand and draw your signature in here the other hand what did you observe what was the difference your regular hand was easy right it was like you know simple easy however the other hand when you try to do it you could do it however it wasn't perfect it was a bit embarrassing awkward and it wasn't uh, perfect right so similarly friends uh, there are few aspects uh, which are very easy to you just like how you drew with your uh, predominant hand yeah so i request you to explore uh, such activities 
yeah uh, and there are other activities as well you know which uh, people claim to have more money and you know all such stuffs and uh, you might be able to do those activities as well uh, as a job as a career right however that might be a bit difficult and awkward just like how you uh, did your signature with your other hand yeah so i request you to find your signature there are many tests uh, online which you can fi find you know based on your um, you know your your personality uh, as per analysis as per mbti uh, there are around 16 personalities in the world though all the people are unique there are few traits there are few aspects um, you know and characteristics which uh, are common yeah so the world is divided into 16 personality traits as per mbti so every personality have their own every personality has their own sweet spots their their own uh, you know sweet career spots yeah so i request you to take such uh, tests those tests are not uh, you know uh, difficult the day to day uh, questions you know do you like to party and uh, what kind of a person are you there will be multiple choice answers so uh, based on the, the the result you can find your uh, personality and then based on that you can find your dream job yeah so uh, i request you to explore such tests and you can uh, purchase my book uh, seven dream jobs and how to find them i've clearly uh, made down a path you know how to find your uh, dream job yeah and every person has their own seven dream job so what dream job you have might not be same for the other person right so i request you to purchase the book read that and you'll understand uh, you know uh, what kind of jobs you can take up so uh, there are many other uh, tips uh, to stardom as well like you know find your personality as i mentioned uh, so if you studied engineering or law, it doesn't mean eventually you, you have to be a software engineer or a lawyer. Yeah. So um, if you, I mean, if you were in Paleolithic age, so there were only two jobs, hunter, gatherer. But now there are plethora of jobs, thousands of jobs, right? Uh, you know, have, have you played games like Minecraft, PUBG and many others? So people are making billions of dollars, right? So it it wasn't the mainframe uh, uh, you know job uh, you know 30 40 years before right so i request you to explore before you make a decision yeah and also please have a side hustle so um, many people f you know feel that i only have this one job uh, you know i don't know if, if there is a layoff you know i don't know what happens so if you have more number of jobs in i mean not job income sources yeah if you have more number of income sources then um, you'll be much comfortable right so have a side hustle have a sunday project on a daily basis on a weekday uh, you have to be yourself you know be um, you know be a student or a teacher or, or an employee or or what not however on a sunday you are what you are right so i request you to take a couple of hours off uh, on a weekend and please explore some hobby and have one or two hobbies at a time yeah don't have you don't try your hands in 10 kinds of hobby on a single day and you know uh, run helter skelter it will be a firefight so do, don't do that have one or two uh, you know example if you want to uh, you know try your hands in uh, you know uh, learning how to code or you know create a blog or a youtube channel or explore and you know learn cricket basketball or table tennis what not so please go ahead and try one or two uh, hobbies at a time during your uh, weekend yeah and you never know maybe one day that can be your side hustle yeah so example for me I i'm a full-time software engineer yet um you know i write yeah uh, i can make this a full-time career as well now uh my books have sold more than 100000 copies but yet uh, you know i'm having this as a side hustle you know because i like the job i i like the, the software engineering which i'm doing it's my sweet spot it's my signature so i request you to explore yourself find your signature and also have a side hustle yeah 
and in my books you know i have uh, written many more tips you know like memory techniques two chair technique time management uh, you know how to write an uh, resume faqs uh, best practices in your new job uh, you know so on so forth so so please uh, try to purchase the book online it's cheaper than a mcdonald meal uh, it's it's within 190 rupees uh, if you if there are few coupons then maybe at around 100 130 rupees online yeah so please uh, go ahead and purchase and i'm sure it will definitely help you out yeah because day in day out i've been receiving a lot of reviews uh, that the book is definitely helping them out yeah and i'm reachable on uh, chandandeshmukh.com and awkwardpage.com i've started doodling so uh, that's available awkwardpage.com and i'm social so you can reach out to me on facebook insta twitter uh, and uh, you know more on facebook uh, yeah so you can reach out to me and uh, throw out your questions in case uh, you don't have time to ask questions here so uh, I would like to end this session with, with a with a quick story. Yeah. So long ago in South Africa, there was a balloon seller. You know, the balloon which uh, floats in the air, the helium neon balloons, inert gas balloons. So um, there was a balloon seller who was selling these balloons and uh, South Africa, you know, right? The, the skin tone is a bit dark. Uh, so there was a kid who walked in. He was looking at all the balloons which, which were flying in the air. Uh, and he asked the balloon seller uncle i can see the red balloon fly the white color balloon is also flying however you also have a black one in your box so will that also fly so this balloon seller got the intent of the question he understood that the answer which he would give will matter a lot to the kid so he said kid come over here it doesn't matter what color of the balloon is all that matters is what is inside of it. So, ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't matter what caste, creed, religion, you know, gender you belong to. All that matters is what is inside of you. Thank you. Yes, Prachi. Thank you. Prachi, Ravi, in case you're speaking, you're on mute. Thank you so much for this wonderful session, sir. It was pleasure having you today for the topic. Also, I extend my gratitude to the publishers, Penguin Classics. On behalf of Orange City Literature Fest, we sincerely express our gratitude towards your acceptance for this session and knowledge shared with us. Definitely. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Praji. Thank you, Ravi. And thank you, everybody. For your participation. Have a great rest of the day and weekend. Bye bye. Twenty years of existence. Two universities. Twenty three educational institutes. Offering a hundred and thirty seven courses. Sony Group of Institutions. A vision beyond.